Green News Service. The Kashmir Chamber of Commerce and Industry has been observing with growing concern the unleashing of what could possibly only be referred to as Operation Bedlam on the helpless citizens of Kashmir. Deliberate leaking of otherwise classified information regarding movement of troops, official orders and details of meetings, discussions, issuance of orders liable to create panic in the public in addition to the rumors and propaganda have resulted in pushing the state towards a crisis of unprecedented proportions. The latest in the series in the government order number home 881 of 2019 dated 2-8-2019 issued by Principal Secretary of Government Home Department. The order states that in view of latest intelligence input of terror threats with specific targeting of the Amarnath Yatra and given the prevailing security situation in the Kashmir Valley in the interest of safety and security of the tourists and Yatris, it is advised that they may curtail their stay in the valley immediately and take necessary measures to return as soon as possible. Simultaneously, a major operation in which vehicles of the SRTC and other government vehicles were mobilized to shift tourists and yatris back. Read with circulation of the reports of stationing of 35,000 additional troops putting Indian Air Force on high alert disarming of sections of the JNK police, shifting of students from NIT and other educational institutions, disallowing free movement of civilians and political leaders, triggered political <coughs> public hysteria in Kashmir. The first response of the public was panic stocking of essentials like provisions, petrol and withdrawal of cash from ATMs. As a result, petrol pumps, ATMs and shops were dry by late evening. The population is being exposed to undesirable psychological games. The order has not only forced tourists and yatris to leave the valley, but has also triggered a migration of the workforce and labor working in various businesses, developmental and infrastructural pro projects in the state.